We are now ready for the words that Eric and Jennifer want to hear the most today. The words that will take them across the threshold from being engaged to being married. Is there anyone here that objects? If so, feel free to leave. <laughs> hey, Eric, I knew my life was forever changed the night we met. You have given me a love I've never known before and a happiness I didn't know was possible. You're a man who has such a love of life and exemplifies hard work and integrity. All of these qualities make you an example to our three kids. Bella, James, and I are so blessed to have you and Hunter in our lives. You and I have created such a beautiful blended family together. I'm so grateful that we found our way to each other. You're the love of my life and my happily ever after. Rising sun hits the sky, see it open. step takes you closer oh, 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 oh. the stars will show us oh, 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 oh. it's all waiting for us every turn and living color heaven knows what we'll discover a story in the making the world is ours for the taking the day I met you, my life changed forever. And not just because I fell in love with you, but because I fell in love with Bella and James too. I promise to always turn on the dishwasher before I come to bed. I promise to move your classroom as many times as you need. I promise to stop to get you a venti iced coffee with extra soy and sugar-free vanilla anytime I'm near a Starbucks. I promise to always have a minute to go get chocolate milk and iced coffee out of the garage. And I promise to listen when you've had a tough day at work. I promise to protect you, and I promise to celebrate your triumphs and love you all the more when you are struggling. I was a little late to be your first love, but I'm prepared to be your last. And I promise I'm going to spend every minute for the rest of my life loving you. Jen and Eric first met, like you saw in that video at their divorce attorney's office, which I thought was fate. And I just remember Jen being really excited about Eric, but Eric was like that first little bit of light. So I was especially excited though, because he's in law enforcement. So they go on their first date, and of course I make her share her location with me. So she texts me as soon as the date is over, and possibly throughout it a little bit, that she had the best time, and just how perfect Eric was. We went to a comedy show, and he was wearing a shirt with a pig, dressed as a police officer on a motorcycle with donut wheels and then he had a button-up donut shirt like little tiny donuts all over and I'm thinking oh my gosh we're going into a comedy show the memory also that sticks out the absolute most was when he and Hunter came to one of James's baseball games and I just thought wow here he is Jen's future husband and the best stepfather that James and Bella could have asked for fast forward a year and a half later and Eric's asking me to help him find a ring for Jen and now here we are today experiencing another magical moment in their lives. Uh, one of my first memories of, of meeting Jen when I was invited to their house for dinner. I remember the home exuded warmth and positivity expected of a teacher. And that warmth was clearly stoked by the caring, kindness, and love shared between Eric and Jen and also Hunter, Bubba, and Bella. Congratulations Eric and Jen. It's great to be part of the family, and I'm looking forward to many memories ahead. When she shared the story with me about the guy at the attorney's office, my protective mode was on high alert at this point, and I was skeptical, but supportive and excited. Fast forward to about a month or so later, and we double drape to the Kane Brown concert. I think every one of us was a bundle of nerves that night, but not for very long. My first impression of Eric was he was fun. He was normal, thank goodness. I love that he wants to spend all his time with her. I physically see his love for her in everything he does. You are both so blessed to have found each other.
taken.